Okay, here's another video showing some interesting behavior with soft serial enabled in clean flight. Um, as you can see, I've enabled the VBAT RX serial, soft serial GPS and telemetry. Um, all are running right now. If I go take a look at receiver and you bear with the slow speed, um, what will happen is the unit will reboot. Uh, we'll get a considerable delay while the unit's booting up. Um, and you can see the uh, erratic lights on the uh, unit itself flashing green <clears throat> periodically. Um, We, actually, we don't get any updates on the uh, receiver tab. Um, if I head over to the command line interface, you can see the, the very, very slow response coming back in from the command line. Uh, the board is actually still initializing the gyros. Uh, the green light is flashing uh, periodically every few seconds uh, doing the uh, initialization process. Um, so we're not getting anything in on the uh, receiver, obviously, because it's not reading yet, or it appears to not be reading. Um, if I do a list of the features, <clears throat> again, you can see that they're, they're still enabled. Um, and then I'll pull up the settings page real quick, and we'll let this print out. Uh, you can actually see them as they scroll by. It's, it's slow enough. We have it set to 5, 3, 2, 4. The GPS baud rate is 9600. Uh, so 5 on serial 1 is everything but telemetry. 3 on serial 2 is the RX serial for SBUS. 2 on serial 3 is for GPS at 9600 baud. And 4 on serial 4 is for telemetry output only. Um, so the unit is actually still flashing the green light like it's booting. Um, if I drop out of this and go anywhere else, we'll get the slow delay. Uh, so we'll let the cycle repeat itself, and then I'll head back over to the command line interface and disable telemetry, and you'll see the response in this of the uh, board kick back in. I still get uh, zero input on any um, of the RX serial uh, commands. Uh, if I head back over here, though, and then we just uh, simply disable telemetry... Um, and then I set that serial port back to zero uh, just so it's a, a valid configuration and it doesn't reset all my settings. I found that it's uh, it's very sensitive um, as far as being sure that all of your settings are correct. Uh, so we'll set this scenario uh, to zero. Uh, so serial port four scenario equals zero. And then once that's completed, um, we'll go ahead and head back to the initial setup. Um, and the board will wake up and become responsive again uh, as soon as it reboots. Um, and so now it's you can see it's it's uh, still booting the gyros up. Let me calibrate the accelerometer real quick. And you can see that the response is back on the on the board and over in the command line interface. Um, I get the uh, expected results when I do a print. Uh, let's re-enable those two features again. Feature telemetry and then serial. We'll set serial port for scenario equal to four, which is telemetry only. Uh, real quick before I hit enter there, just to uh, recap on those settings um, for serial, you can see they're still set to 532, which is uh, default except for telemetry, uh, all the serial data except telemetry. Uh, RX serial and GPS on port 3 and then of course we have GPS set to 9600 uh, there on the baud rate um, although I, I did verify with uh, this morning that it could go up to 192 
Uh, so we have telemetry enabled now at the bottom, uh, and I'm going to uh, set serial port four scenario back to four for telemetry out. I'll hit enter here, and then I'll hop out to the initial tab. Uh, the board will save and reboot, and you'll see the delayed response now when the board boots back up. So we get the, uh, the waiting loader, um, and then now the, the board, uh, it appears to be booted, um, however it, it is not. Uh, the gyro light is still, it's flashing green. Um, it's actually solid green, and then it will begin to flash in a moment while it initializes the gyros. So it's almost as if the calibration com procedure never completes. And of course this causes the, even though I'm, I'm lifting the unit here, uh, you can see there's no effect uh, to anything um, over here on the, on the uh, GUI. So I'll head back over and uh, simply disable those again, um, just so I can have the unit usable. So we'll disable uh, feature telemetry, and then uh, we'll set that serial port. Set serial port four. So there we go. Equal to zero. I want to disable that. Um, then we'll save. To, uh, reboot the board. It's actually still saving, uh, so it just now rebooted, and you can see that it comes up uh, as quick, uh, quick like we would expect a, a typical boot. Um, and there we have the board is uh, completely initialized. Over here, um, if I head back over to the receiver tab, you'll see that I get uh, responsiveness on my uh, transmitter sticks. Uh, it's, it's now reestablished, uh, which is uh, what we would expect. So, uh, seems to be some issues with soft serial. Uh, just trying to help document those.